and for Spike. It, it kind of started off that way. They just wanted to see what I did with them at first, without even hearing the original Japanese, which is even crazier. And uh, I just found myself mesmerized by the visuals and the music. And um, they they uh, they took out the original Japanese vocal, but they had all the, the sound effects and the music and everything. And it was so visually stunning. I just all I wanted to do was just sit there for you know, an hour and watch the show. I didn't really care about the recording part of it, and I really wasn't sure what to do. It was my first leading role in anything. And uh, so from that point forward, you know, there was there's sort of this vacuum that we all work in where we do the job, and then six months to a year later, it airs somewhere. And in this case, it went straight to DVD, I think, in the first uh, the series. And um, I didn't get any feedback at all. It's not like being on stage where you have an audience and you know what's going to happen. And all of a sudden, this, this groundswell started happening, and I started getting input from people and saying, this is 